I have a basic installation of the Ubuntu 14.04 server here on the left and it's running in a virtual machine and my goal is to install the SSH server so that I can remotely log into this computer and once I remotely log in I can usually do one of two things. I can either send commands to it that will allow me to manipulate or run the operating system from another location or I can also use it for file transfer. And In this case I want to focus mostly on being able to execute commands remotely. So to begin with, I'll need to log in. And before I install anything, it's good practice to update your repositories. So sudo apt-get update. Okay, so now that it's done, I'm going to go ahead and run the command sudo apt-get install, and this one is open ssh-server, and I'm going to go ahead and hit enter, and this is going to install the package. Now, the default here, if I hit enter, is yes. It's going to ask if I want to install the following packages, so I'll just go ahead and hit enter. Alright, so now I have it installed. If I run an ifconfig, I can see what my IP address is, which is 192.168.2.112. And again, if you are running this on a virtual machine, you will want to make sure that the adapter for the network adapter on this virtual machine is on your local subnet. And you can do that by going to Devices, Network, Network Settings, and making sure that it says Bridged Adapter. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and connect to it now from my host computer. So over here I have PuTTY downloaded, and it's a free application, which is very common on the Windows platform to connect into a Linux computer. So I'll go ahead and double click it, and I'll need to enter in my IP address. So that's going to be 192.168.2.112. And I'll go ahead and hit enter. It's going to ask me if I want to accept the encryption key, so I'm going to go ahead and say yes. And I can log in as, so I'll type in my name and my password. And I've logged in. So now I'm remotely logged into the same computer that I have for the Ubuntu, uh, remotely using PuTTY using the SSH protocol, which is encrypted. So this is a great way to remotely log into another Linux computer or Unix based computer using the SSH server.